Hello, my name is Stuart Fraser. I am a landscape artist. Welcome to my studio. Recently had to replace my old easel after many years of hard work. So do I replace it with an expensive, many hundreds of pounds easel? Or do I try one of these cleated wall easels which is doing the rounds on YouTube? I won't go into any lengths about building them because there's many videos out there. What I will say, I used this pre-built cleated moulding from a picture frame that made life very, very easy. And for canvases, it's brilliant. Flat to the wall, great for photography, and just shoot straight onto it. Perfect. A lot more space in my studio. There's no big easel in the way. But what if, like me, you paint on canvas boards? Pieces of MDF backing board. In fact, if I can put two coats of gesso onto it, I'll paint on it. I also use these gummed paper pads, especially for sketches and studies if I'm trying things out. So how do you attach these thin pieces of board mounts to a cleated wall easel? My solution I had an old desktop easel, which I cut down to its basics, attached a cleat to the back. Perfect. Really, really simple. You know, it'll take boards up to 24 by 20 inches, and that tends to be my maximum anyway. Over that, I'll go to a canvas. What if you haven't got one of these? Well, you could try making yourself something like this. this is, it's a bit Heath Robinson. It's just an old, an old painting on MDF. Just cut a groove down the middle, a bolt in the back, a wing nut, a piece of wood for the support, and that'll do exactly the same job. So there you go. There's my solutions for using MDF, canvas boards, paper, backing boards, anything you want. Simple cost-effective. I hope that helps.